Hey guys, this is Scythe here, and today I'm going to be showing you how to build an automatic item sorter. Now, automatic item sorters are useful in several scenarios. Most commonly, if you have a mob grinder, you know how long it might take to go through all the items that are dropped, especially witch grinders, zombie grinders. You usually want like the specific items to go through. This is good for zombie pigment grinders as well because you can sort the gold swords from the ingots from the nuggets. It's just very useful, very cheap to build and very easy. So what you're gonna need for this project is redstone dust, redstone repeaters, redstone comparators, hoppers, any block of your choice. I'll be using brick, redstone torches. You're going to need chests and trap chests. Now to start off with you're going to want to place your line of chests I'll just keep it simple and you can replace the underside of this if you want with brick Okay, so now we've got this, and now you want to make a line of hoppers going into the chest. Make sure it doesn't go into the sand. You have to have it going into the chest. Now, under these hoppers, under these hoppers, you're going to want to do redstone torches. So now that I think about it, it would probably be smarter if we broke those and just went straight across, like so, and then just placed redstone torches under the hoppers. Now, just go like so. There we go. Now, take another line of hoppers. You want to make another line of hoppers, and to do so, we're going to need to shift click and place brick like so I'll then just place the hoppers like this now break the brick all right now that's your second line of hoppers done now take your brick your material of choice go like this and then place the hoppers going into the material of your choice make sure they go across like that and they don't go into those now once you got that you need to add one on the end here this is where the items will go in this will be the one where the cycle starts now you're going to want to take your block of your choice go back here and place comparators like so Now, go like this. Now, place redstone dust. Make sure that's turned off. You don't want to turn one of those on by accident. Okay, now you've got all your redstone dust set up. Go under here. And we gotta place repeaters under this. Okay, now just make a little, actually, we need to do this one at a time. Get your repeater out. I'm just gonna do this like this. back up excuse me there we go now we can just place another one like so just keep placing until you've got a line right there now basic redstone are you done and at the end, if you want, you can add a hopper where it just goes straight down. There's no redstone. And what this will do is it'll make it so any item that 
you don't want in those chests go away. So we can just go like this. I'll just climb up here. Go like that. I'll jump up another one. Go like this. And now you've got your miscellaneous one. That's basically all you need to do aside from this. Open up this middle hopper right here. Actually, now think about it. We need to get rid of these items. Get what are you whatever you want to filter out. I'll get diamond blocks. Actually, we'll do wool with this. Get all the materials. How many? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. We need seven materials. Three, six, seven. Now, you need to get something that's never going to go into those filters. I recommend bedrock, personally, just because that seems to be something no one's going to put into these filters. So, place 18, like so, and then put a line whatever that material is and now we'll do purple now just do that for every material you have just keep going down the line Last one. Whoops. Go across one. Okay, so now it's set up. Make sure nothing's in that one. Now, whenever you throw, we're just going to throw the items that we have. Let's just put this into our hot bar. Now, check this chest. This one is blue, so that has nothing in it, as you saw. So we're just going to throw one in there. I think it was this one. As you can see, it lit up. Now we check this chest. Which one did it go into? There we go. We can throw this another one in. And it went in. This is the backflow one. You need to throw, there will always be one in that, so you just throw this in. And it'll move it okay so I'm just gonna throw all these into the chest like so now when we go to the respective chests you can see it's filling up of course it's got to move down the queue that one's done it's got to move down the line here You'll see it light up in a moment. Peters are working. There we go. Yellow's filling up. Excellent. I don't recommend you open these trap chests while it's going down. Otherwise, it might mess the redstone signal up by sending it out but you shouldn't have that issue. It is going to take a second for it to go down. As you can see, it is working. I think I opened that trap chest, which caused the redstone to screw up. But, you know. Like I said, don't do that. Just throw it in. We can look and see if it's going in and out. Indeed, it is. Now the rest is gone. That's miscellaneous. 
as you can see it's moving in and out and it is working now so don't yeah don't open the chest while it's doing that otherwise you'll have to re-enter it in now here's something the dark oak planks which we didn't put in now if we throw that in there it should go all the way down here and just go into the miscellaneous chest which as you can see works good so yeah this is the basic items automatic item sorting now I'm gonna show you how to cover up some of the redstone if you want it to look nice you can go like this you have to have one above the block remember to allow the chest to open so you can just go around this There we go. Now, let's just fill in right here. We've got another one right here. Another wall. There we go. Now to make this look presentable in the front here fill it in there we go nice little item sorter and if you want you can take item frames put it above like so and I usually do this actually I can just shift click just have this valve right here now just to test one last time you see that's seeing so we're gonna take another stack of sea and wool just go right here and throw all 64 pieces in now it'll go into the valve you'll see it going in and out and it'll be going into the chest alright that's basically it guys very cheap very easy to do and I hope you'll leave a subscribe and a like and check out gld.bz which I'll put the IP in the top right hand corner of the screen. I'll put the website in the top left. And as always, have fun.